Hi guys, in this video, I'm going to discuss about count a string length without using inbuilt function. So there is a length function. So without using length function, uh, we have to count the length of any string of words. So I have to enter the string or words. So I enter hello friend. So add a, uh, this. There is a uh, uh, five character and here or uh, seven. So this is five. Here yeah, seven. So seven plus five, the value come thirteen, and one is blank space. Seven plus five, the value come twelve, and twelve plus one blank space, the output come thirteen. So let's uh, let's uh, see the code. Now I'm going to write the code. So first is a scanner cross. Going to create the scanner cross object. A scanner. A scanner. New. A scanner system class dot in and hereafter let's take a string variable as to and hereafter going to write system class dot out dot print or print method so right here I'm going to write enter a string slash words. So right here what am I going to enter? So that you see by str. So write str equal to sc dot next line. And here after I'm going to take integer variable i initializing to zero. Here after let's write for and here care c colon str dot. So right here I'm going to write to care array method and here after write system class dot r dot print method so i'm going to print out here c value now here after let's increase i so i plus plus and here after our system dot out dot print allen so right here I'm going to print or slash n at your length length equal to plus so can get it I well now let's execute the code So right here I'm going to write hi or uh, friends. So right here or uh, getting hi friends and your length 10. Let's uh, execute one more time. Hi guys. So right here, or uh, it's the total character or uh, seven h i or uh, two times h u y s. This is four times and one or uh, blank space. So total character seven. So here length displaying seven. Next, I'm going to discuss about the trial method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main method. Here after that, go inside. So I have created a scanner class object sc by using new a scanner system dot in. Here after I have taken a string variable str. And here after system class dot out dot print method. So what are we do got that displayed to the output screen. So enter the string slash words so that displaying to the output screen. 
here s s tier equal to sc dot next line so sc is the object of a scanner class dot operator so that called next line method so next line method so that accept a string value and that string value that go to s tier so at here str value i'm going to use into h e and o here after one more variable i so that is initialized to zero here after control comes to this point so at here for char c colon str dot to char array so at here here i'm using colon so that means it acts as a for each row so at your in c sharp programming language i used for each row so this in java we have to use like this way so for char c colon str dot to char array so i want to char array so it convert a string into character array so whatever a string value so this all are a string value so that convert into character and that character value go to c so one by one str so first time so first time going to do indexing this is a zero index here one this is two here three and here four so first time str zero Position char value go to or C and here after control comes to this point system class dot odd dot print so that print C value so C value first time receive S T R of zero so H receive here after I in case I is one now next that go so this time that to receive S T R one so one position e is there so E go to C and c value print so c value is e so e print here after that increase the value of i so i is 2 now so at here str2 so str2 position l is there so l go to c and that print c so c value is l so l print here after i increase so i is 3 now check the condition so there is no so this time that receive s t of 3 person so 3 person l is there so l value go to c so this time c receive l here after i in 4 now so at here s t of 4 person 4 person is o so o go to c and print c value so that print o here after there is no any value so at here fifth person null character so since there is no any value or null characters there so that odd from so here after printing the c value so that increase the value of i so i value is now 5 here after that go so this point at fifth version str value is null character so when the null character is there so that odd from fall so here after control comes to this point so system class dot odd dot print and a method so that print i value so i value is 5 so 5 print and here h e double l so this first time that print h e l l o so it looks like this is a symbol but if you give at here print l and method so what will happen So I'm going to into hello. So first time that receive str zero person h, then str one, str two, str three, str four. So first time the output come h, next e, next l, next l, o. So let's place into. So at here h e double l l o. So total character here five. So yeah, length fine so this is the try and method of this program so i hope guys this video is helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week